You can use basic shapes within Apple Motion to create some cool effects. Let's start with these two boxers. Go ahead and edit a single clip to the timeline. Then drag it directly above itself by using the Option plus Shift keys to create a duplicate. Right click on the top track and choose Send to Motion Project. Give your motion project file a name and save it. Click anywhere within the motion canvas window and use the keyboard shortcut Command minus to zoom out a bit to see your full video frame. Press Command 4 to bring forward the Layers tab. Move over to the Tool Palette and select the Circle Tool. Draw a large circle in the canvas window for the flame particle to follow. You can now turn off the background layer in the circle object within the Layers tab. Move over to the Library tab and look for the Flame Line Particle. It's located within the Particle Emitters Pyro category. Drag the Flame Line Particle into the Canvas window. If you press play, you can see the flame object. Click on the Add Behavior button at the top of the toolbar. Choose Basic Motion, Motion Path. Notice how the flame starts to follow a basic path. Now move over to the Inspector tab. Change the pull down menu for the path shape to Geometry. Go ahead and drag the Circle object from the Layers tab into the Shape Source Well. OK, notice how the flame starts to follow the path object. To get the flame to move around the circle, increase the number of loops. Now click onto the Emitter tab for the flame particle. To make this effect look cool, increase the birth rate and scale for the flame particle. OK, awesome! Notice how the flame follows around your circle object. Go ahead and save the project, and then press Command-H to hide the motion interface to get back to Final Cut Pro. For other great tips like this, or to enroll in a Final Cut Pro training course, visit GeniusDV.com.